Subterranean Architect here, and today we're going to be playing Grounded. Um, we're going to be starting a new series, so uh, let's jump right in and see what happens. Alright, <clears throat> you said you're going to be Pete. Hey, I'm Willow. Or, Willow be, no, don't be fucking, don't be Pete. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, Brook Hollow. Today is October 20, 1990. This is your news. We have a special breaking report. The police department has released information that more local teenagers have gone missing. They were last seen earlier this week, and the only connection between the teenagers is that they are all students at Brook Hollow High School. This could be linked to the disturbing trend of other possible abductions and missing teenagers from our otherwise quiet town. If anyone has seen the teenagers or has any other information, please contact the police department. The mayor of Brook Hollow has put a curfew into effect for anyone under 18 starting tonight. Now to other news. In the business world, Ominous Practical Technology signs a few deal with... Nightmare. My favorite. Well, what version is it? Endless cave, bottomless pit, impossibly claustrophobic passages, inexplicable presence of random right. classmates. Give me mouse there we go. This is a new one. Ah, you see me in your dreams. So we're Willow? just gonna run up here, right? And yep. Grab this. It's a nightmare. Whatever this thing is, science. Mm -hmm. The solitary ant. One of a hundred thousand Get your pamphlets and your screens and all that. Oh, no yeah. hopes, no dreams, bound to the will of the colony. <clears throat> Willow. Sometimes an ant is detective. just an ant. What was that? I'm probably just gonna sort of radio stay with you because you've done this a hundred times from? now. Set up all the sciencey stuff here. I'm gonna just keep doing the this little quest line thing for now. Like have a little things like that. Have a little sprint. What is going on? Right. Okay. I should keep looking around. I guess I'll run to this. Uh, what you call it? I don't even know what this thing is. Okay, that is definitely not normal. It's like giant Game Boy thing. <laughs> What's the worst thing that could happen? Looks like something is happening. Nothing happens. Looks like the other two lasers are blocked. All After right. all that build up, this big mysterious computer doesn't do anything. Make an axe. Man. Nope. Gonna make some rope first. You can make your spear and axe down too. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I don't ever use the spear, to be honest. We'll make some more rope though, because we always seem to run out of rope. And then, yeah. 
V is the hotkey, right? Or your uh, click bar, whatever you call it. Uh, that's your build menu. I think it's V. That's what I Unless said. Unless you said V. Yep. Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> v as in Victor. Mm -hmm. Alright. Hey, buddy. Now we're gonna now? go kill the mites, right? Whoa, really look at the size of that egg. Honestly, I'm just glad it's not big enough to squish me. Last time I chopped down the grass not before. So what do you mean? There's another one. Oh, never mind. Here. No, you There's a grass oh. leaf over here. Yeah. I see. Alright, well, I'll just head to the mites while you do that. I need a less clicky keyboard now. torch is that the only way to get the torch recipe yeah to run into the dark beat it nosy yeah. all right so we're gonna set up camp after this after burgle and then we're going straight for the wolf spider. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> That's what you tried to do before, right? Yeah, it didn't work out too well. <laughs> Actually, put that on three. I don't want the pebblet on my hotbar. What do we have lurking around out here? Looks like that little red thing's itching for a fight. Oh, you scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I turn around and <laughs> your face was right in my camera. <laughs> you know, a lot of this is going to be so much easier with two people, actually, because everything I've been doing by myself has been so freaking slow. What do you mean? Like harvesting and fighting bigger stuff? Yeah, like I just today it took me like four hours to kill two bosses because it was just go gather this and do this and do that. Just all prep work. Yeah. Ugh, did not make that jump. So behind that wall down there in those rocks. Where did you go? Once you get out behind you. Uh oh. More toward the house, you mean? Yeah, I'm right in front of you. No, those rocks that were down in that cave. There's oh, a bulk oh. more down there, and there's a bunch of upgrade materials. Are all the milk molars level 2 hammer? Yes. Um, oh, okay. Because there's one in the burgle area. There's two in that burgle area, actually. Yeah, they're, they're all uh, <clears throat> uh, level 2. Which, honestly, it's not hard to get to level 2. I figured out a way to cheese everything. Okay. And I also know a spot to get um, another weapon. It's a level 3 weapon, but you can get it super early as soon as you unlock the bombs. The bombs? Yeah. That was okay. Than I if there's any ants, kill the ants. Make it clear at this point that you need a lot of ant parts button, this, like, early. Uh, okay. should find out what happens. And ants are uh, weak to stab damage. Uh, and is the spear stab or is that like a slash? Spear stab. Okay. Get some of this juice. Ow! Did I hit you? Yeah, you almost murdered me. I didn't know there was uh. 
Yeah, there's friendly fire. Yeah, I didn't know that was on. I didn't know that was a thing. What the heck? Is something burrowing under there? <clears throat> All right. Straight to the burgle. So this ant hill is actually useless. This is the one you kept going to before, right? It's absolutely useless. Is that I'm a milk molar? No. Where? No, that's a pebble. That's a rock. Seems like something's digging around in the Yeah, so this stick right here, off this, is where I've been building now. What do you mean? Up like here. You go up this stick right here. Oh, and then oh. Just right up I here. jump up right through here, and my base is right here. Like all this area, all the way to the light. Oh, okay. Every once in a while, you get a wolf spider that's this high to you. Yeah, well. Oh, come this way again? Sorry. Actually, just go to Virgil if you want to. I'm gonna okay. go grab another field station. <laughs> so, you like this game, don't you? Like. It's fun, dude. Because sure. you seem like not sure about it when you. Uh, yeah, at first I was like, ah, I don't know, this game looks kind of stupid, and then I started playing, and it's like, oh, this game's actually pretty good. Yeah. <clears throat> I told you. Oh, you're researching more. Yeah, but the research station by Burgle will have the ability to research as well. Right, right. Oh yeah, there's no... I keep forgetting they don't, don't have those robots in here anymore. Okay. Well, is there anything I, that you need me to research, like the ant parts or anything? I mean, ant parts are just gonna, if you research, I think it's the bodies or the parts, maybe the head. I know the head gives you the head piece. Okay, I'll just research the ant part. Yeah, arm guards, knee guards, helmet, ant club, and a chair. Yeah, that's all we really need is those three right now. Yeah, and I'll do the mite fuzz, I guess. That'll unlock the arrows for us? I believe so, yes. Yeah. Yep, and a hat. And some other... So you murdered me, now I'm dead. I did not murder you. I'll do the weevil nose, too, because that'll get us the gas mask. Yeah, I'm going to have to respawn at the, uh, at the kid case. Oh, never mind. It puts me right here at this research station right next to us. Let me know that. Right where you were? Close to it. Uh, oh, yeah. And then all the sap you could ever want. But not really. <clears throat> Bubba -bu Burgle. We can fix this. System reboot in progress. Thanks for the helping hand. I am B -b 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 Burgle, acting science manager for this project. I am also a robot. I am sure this all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. Scientists make this look harder than it is. I am sure this all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. I suspect you were miniaturized by Dr. Tully's spacer device. Why are you here in the yard? I do not know. In fact, I cannot seem to recall much of anything. 
A recent power surge has caused a massive raw science containment explosion. This lab, as you can see, is a disaster. And what's worse, the explosion has disrupted my computing power. My memory banks are corrupted. Sorry to pile on the bad news, my new friend. How can I be of service? You are here, in the Oak Lab, built and used by Dr. Wendell Tadelli to experiment on all things small. This is the base of operations for conducting experiments in his yard. Dr. Tully is a brilliant scientist and inventor. He is also my creator. My initial protocol was to serve as the short order cook of the future. However, I have been recently promoted to acting science manager to assist with his experiments. No doubt my previous work experience has been invaluable to Dr. Tully. Although, now that I am processing it, I have not seen him for several weeks. And now I cannot recall where he went. It must be my corrupted memory banks. It seems you and I are both a little discombobulated. Given my best calculations, your biomass has been subject to covalent spacing reduction via interatomic energy extraction. In other words, you have been shrunk. It is likely this was achieved using Dr. Wendell Tully's spacer platform, patent pending. Shrinking can be a traumatic experience for tiny human brains, and memory loss is a known side effect. Hopefully your memory will return in time. To return to your prior size, you would need to successfully activate Dr. Tully's spacer platform. Unfortunately, my readings indicate it is inoperable. It appears to have suffered several malfunctions from the explosion. I am sorry, but it appears you may be stranded here for some time until we find a solution. Haha! <laughs> that is a great idea! Let me run a full diagnostic scan on it and see what we need to do to get it fixed up. Processing! Processing! Memory fault! Code 408B3000! Ominent OS script runtime error! Arg! I am sorry again! It appears I have sustained more damage to my memory chips than expected. Without those memories, I do not know how to repair the spacer. Dr. Tully used two types of chips to back up my memory. Auxiliary chips are small capacity chips used to store project data. If you find these, I should be able to help you learn new survival recipes. Super chips are special, and they are gold. They back up full directories of my memory system. If we are going to fix the spacer, that data is bound to be on a super chip. I suggest exploring the other labs in the backyard. Return with any memory chips you find. Dr. Tully has built many more labs throughout the yard. Each lab is used for various experimental procedures. I can upload their locations to your scabby. Stand by. Processing. Processing. Error. Files not found. Code 632C404. Cheese and fries! The lab locations are missing from my memory banks, too! But we are in luck! I was able to retrieve the location of one of the facilities, the Hedge Lab. The Hedge Lab is the observation center of the yard and used for research on arachnid webbing. You will find the hedge near the house if you head southeast. The lab is located deep inside the hedge, sending the coordinates to your scabby. Try to find the hedge lab first, but there is nothing stopping you from searching the yard for the other labs. Except, of course, thousands of angry, hungry insects. <laughs> that reminds me. Dr. Tully locks the important labs with biometric scanners. You will need access for any chance of success. Head over to the ASL terminal and place your hand on the biometric scanner near it. Give it a moment to sync your signature into the mainframe. Once you are registered, you will be granted access to the ASL network of computers, too. 
ASL grants access to daily work items. Nay, tasks. Nay, quests. Yes, quests. I will reward you raw science for each completed quest. In my science shop, you can trade raw science back for survival recipes from experiments that Wendell conducted when he was first exploring the yard. Log on to the ASL terminal over there and see what is available. Unless you have any other questions, you really should get started finding those ch chips and try not to die out there. Have an exponentially great day! Okay. I gotta activate this, uh... What you call it? Hand scanner. And then, uh, we can get the quest upgrades, right? Yeah, I believe so. Alright. Science shop. You said you want the Peblet Foundation? No, not the Peblet one. There's another one that gives you foundation. Scroll through the option on it. Sturdy wall, palisade gate, windowed sturdy wall, palisade, stem floor. Uh, Triangle no. stem floor. Not the stem floor, the grass floor. You did it. Jesus, my gosh. The grass floor? Multi-story bases. Hey there, Is that part of grass floor? Solid floor can also be used the ceiling. Yeah, it has grass floor in it. Spiral yeah, railing. Grass stairs. <laughs> I guess we do need multi-story. Okay. Going to be big. You want that one and you want you want the smithing station? That one's a hundred. Yeah, that and smithing station, yes. Alright. Smithing station is really not going to be used right away, but... Yeah. Alright, and then burgle quests. You just want me to take them all? Well, depending on what they are, I know a couple that are pretty easy. The one is craft a clover hood, yeah, one is craft a gas mask, and one is find the grave robbery burgle chip. Okay, yeah, take all those. I know the grave robbery burgle chip is. Okay. And then, yeah. And then we just hang out until we get all the ant parts to make red ant armor. Oh, you don't want the tank armor, you called it? Why did I do that? Let me go the acorn armor? Code. Nah, I figured out. Some stuffs. It's not so good. It's not as good as I wanted it to be. It's good for early game, but... Alright. Do you have anything set up? Like a foundation or anything? An nah, I was just waiting for you to uh, get all that. All the burgle stuff done. Burgle, burgle. <clears throat> All right. Uh, spiders after me? I don't think so. Get away. The wolf spider's gonna come out soon. Probably what bottled water is. All right. So we need to make a workbench. Yeah. Yeah. I have to find and eat a mushroom. Said ants kill ants. I should have enough for at least one armor set, not both. All right. Well, I killed one ant. I have three ant parts and one head. Okay. I have mandibles and ant parts and all that good stuff. <clears throat> Alright, um, we're gonna build up here, you said? 
Oh, you're right below me. Yeah. Do you need me to get more grass? You want more grass? We'll go find the diamond bit line. Uh, there's one right in front of you. I guess I'll get one of them too. Where does that Right here is where the wolf spider comes out at night, so I'll just be really careful. Oh, that dropped a few. It wasn't two tufts, were there? Just there was three. I'll bring it back. You want more grass, too? Yeah, a little bit more grass. Oh, I didn't think about that. Orb weaver right here. Let me not. Yeah, let me just not. <laughs> so, what makes this base area so much better? Uh, it's just more, like, less resources to have more freedoms. First little bit built. Um, a lean to. You want that over here, or are you gonna build somewhere else? Did you, did you bring two stems back or no, just one? Oh, the dandelion? Yeah, up here. No, this, not the dandelion. The, the stems that fell off the dandelion. The weed stems? No, I didn't bring any. Okay. I didn't know you needed them. Yeah, I just need two more. Okay. And then a buck ton of grass. <laughs> well, let me... Let me just get the basic... Uh, Shelter stuff just kind of set up here. If you research an acorn piece, we can get the chest. You can um, set your spawn point up here. There's a little food going now. 